Good evening, Cindy. How are you tonight? Hello, teacher. Good evening. Okay, very good. Let's give me one second, okay? Okay. No problem.
Okay, how was your day today? How was your day today, Cindy? <coughs> how was your day today, Guille? Very well, teacher. Very good, okay. And what about you, good. Cindy? Good, very good. Glad to be here again. Okay, very good, excellent. Uh, have you worked on the platform? I almost, I almost finished, but I am missing with with some with some exercise to complete the section three. Okay, remember that you have to do the listening carnival time. You listen and write the answers, and then you do a knowledge check. 3.4 and 3.13 oh, no, no, and no. the reading okay and the reading 3.15 so those are the things that you have to complete and then you do the midterm okay don't worry about it we're gonna work on, uh, well, not on the on the carnival time but we're going to work on check out not the check 3.15 okay so let me show you here the Okay, can you see the screen? Yes. Okay, so I guess section one is completed, right, Cindy? Section two is completed, correct? <coughs> and section three, we have to do knowledge check 3.4. We have to do the listening exercise, carnival time. <laughs> Carnival time, so you go here and you have to answer this question based on the on the uh, reading. So you go here and then it will give you here. So you click right here and then you listen. Mike has just returned from Brazil. Listen to him talk about mm -hmm. Is that clear? And yes. based on what you hear, you answer the questions right here. Okay? So that is exercise. Three point, what was that? I don't remember. Okay, so that is exercise 3.6. So you do, you do the knowledge check 3.4, the listening exercise. Then you come to a, adverbial clauses, knowledge check 3.13. And you also do the reading exercise, unique customs. Okay, this, this, and this, we are going to practice tonight, okay? Is that clear? Yeah. And the conversation, but the conversation, there's nothing to do. Okay, just listen to the conversation. Okay, let's see, it's 8.02. Let's see how many of you have come, okay? Okay, good evening, Alexander. How are you tonight? Good evening, Jordana. How are you tonight? Turn on your microphone, Jordana. Turn on your microphone, Jordana. How are you tonight? Hello. Can you hear me? Now I can hear you. How are okay. you tonight? I'm fine. Thank you so much for asking. Um, what about you? Okay, I'm fine. Thanks for asking too. Okay, uh, Jordana, have you worked on the platform? Yes, I have. Uh, have you worked on section one, section two, and section three? Yes, I finished them. And the midterm? I just had, um, no, the midterm I have it at the mid, <laughs> at the middle yeah. as well. Um, I just had issues or problems, let's say, with the carnival wand, like uh, okay. carnival time, because 
it, it has like a section to write down um, the answer about what the carnival is. But the thing is that it did not recognize my answers. Really? Mm, yes. Okay, let me show you. Okay, so the carnival time you're talking about right here. Okay. Did you open the listening? Could you yes, hear I did. the listening? Yes? Yes, I did. Uh -huh. Okay, so this is the listening. Okay, instruction, listen to the audio and answer the following question. Okay, so here, what is carnival? It's a celebration. Okay. Okay. And then you submit. Yes. And I I I write down to, it's a party. And and it make it correct. And that's the only one that I have correct. Keep it's quiet, a party. Could you keep it quiet? And how long does it last? It lasts for four whole days. Four days. And when is it? It is in late February. It is held in late February and or early March. Okay, late February. And? Or early March. Okay. Or early March. Yes. And what is the samba? Is I it brought that it's a music. It's a kind of music. Okay. Music. Okay. Okay. <laughs> music. Okay. So I'm going. Don't worry about it. Okay. So okay. I'm going to check this with the with the uh, with the support team, okay, to see what happens, okay? Sure, thank you. Okay, you're welcome, no problem. And the rest. Hello, you teacher. Have yes, sir. I have the same problem. I try to make that exercise, and uh, and in any occasion have the the the. the correct. Answer. Okay, don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. I will check with the support team and I will give you an answer. And when I give you an answer, you go to this. Uh, you go to this activity and you do it. Okay. Is that clear? Okay. Okay. Thank Very you. good. Very good. Okay. okay. Now, uh, what we're going to do today, okay, and then you do this. By the end of this Sunday, you have to do the midterm. Everyone, let me see your faces. Okay. okay. Ivan, Cindy, Guille, Mario, Eleonora, and Alexandra. Okay. By Sunday, you're supposed to have done the uh, midterm. Okay. Okay. So the only thing that you're going to be leaving is that carnival time, the listening of the carnival time. All right? And I will check. So don't worry about that. Just leave that out, and I will check, and we will see what happens. All right? Okay, very good. So now let's, let's see. This is what we have for tonight, okay? Okay, uh, we have this conversation, okay? That is conversation wedding day. Okay, listen and practice. Okay, you already have it in the video, okay? So I'm just going to uh, read it for you. Your wedding okay. pictures are really beautiful, Emiko. Thank you, those pictures were taken right after the ceremony. Where was the ceremony? At a shrine. 
When people get married in Japan, they sometimes have the ceremony at a shrine. That's interesting. Were there a lot of people there? Well, usually only family members and close friends go to the ceremony. But afterward, we had a reception with family and friends. So what are receptions like in Japan? There's a big dinner and after the food is served, the guests give speeches or sing songs. It sounds like fun. It really is. And then before the guests leave, the bride and groom give them presents. The guests get presents? Yes and the guests give money to the bride and groom. Questions? No, no questions. Are you sure everybody? Yes, no question. No question, Is anybody? Hello, no questions? No questions, sir. Okay, everybody turn on your microphones. Mm -hmm. Okay, turn on your microphones, repeat after me. Your yes. wedding pictures are really beautiful, Emiko. Your wedding, wedding, wedding pictures, pictures are, are really beautiful, Emiko. Thank you, those pictures were taken right after the ceremony. Thank you. Thank you, Thank those you. pictures were, were, taken were taken right after, right after, after the ceremony. ceremony. Where was the ceremony? Where oh, was, where was, was the, the ceremony? ceremony? Uh, at a shrine. When a people shrine. get married in Japan, they sometimes have the ceremony at a shrine. At a, a shrine. shrine. People get married, people Japan. Get married in they Japan. They sometimes have the ceremony at a shrine. The ceremony at a shrine. That's interesting. Were there a lot of people there? That's, That's interesting. interesting. There, there, are there are a lot of people there. there? Well, usually only family members and close friends go to the ceremony. But after well, all, usually we only family members with family and, and friends. close friends go to the ceremony. But after well, well, well usually, usually only family, family, family members, members and close friends go to the ceremony. After all, we have a reception with family and friends. And friends. So, what are receptions like in Japan? So, so what, what are reception, reception like, like in, in Japan? Japan? What are reception? There's a big dinner and after the food is served, the guests give speeches or sing songs. There's a, There's a, a big dinner and after the food is served, is served the guests give speeches or sing songs. Or sing songs. Yep. It sounds like fun. It, it sounds, sounds like, like fun. fun. It really is. And then before the guests leave, the Brian group give them presents. It really is. Bride and groom give them presents. The guests get presents? The guests get presents? Yes, and the guests give money to the bride and groom. Yes, and the guests give money to the bride and groom. Okay, do do are you sure you don't have any questions? Yes. Um, sorry? No. No questions. Okay, no, very no good. Question. Let me see. We have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, so I'm gonna make four pairs so you can role play the conversation, okay? Okay, here we go. Okay, Eleonora and Mario. Go to room number one. Alexandra and Maria Jose, go to room number two. Uh, Ivan and Jordana, go to room number three. Cindy and Guille, go to room number four. And remember, when you finish the conversation, switch roles, please. Okay, Jordana, okay. go to room number three. Cindy, Thank you. Guille, go to room number four. <laughs> Eleonora, go to room number one, please. Jordana, okay. go to room number... Okay. Eleonora, go to room number one. Guille, go to room number four, please. Okay.
I, teacher, please, uh, the share of the... Uh -huh. <laughs> the what happened? Uh, excuse me. Uh, and no where is the book? Uh -huh. <laughs> ah, okay. Go ahead, okay. go ahead. Thank you. <laughs> no problem, no problem. Okay. Go ahead. Um, thank you, teacher. Uh, I I start. Uh, you want to start? reading picture are... Yes, yes. Your reading pictures are really beautiful, Emiko. Thank you. Those pictures were taken right after the ceremony. Where was the ceremony? At a shrine. When people got married in Japan, they something have the ceremony at the sh shrine. Sometimes, sometimes. They sometimes have the ceremony at the shrine. Okay, that's interesting. Were there a lot of people there? Well, usually only family members and close friends go to the ceremony. But after war, we have a reception with family and friends. So, what are the reception like in Japan? There is a big dinner, and after the food is served, served the guests give speeches or sing songs. It sounds like fun. It really is. And then before the guests leave, they preach and groom give them presents. Bride, the bride. Uh, the, the bride. bride. Uh, bride. Okay. okay, the bride and they... groom got the bride and groom give them presents. Okay. The guests get presents? Yes. And the guests give money to the, to the bride and groom. Okay, let's switch roles now. Okay. okay. You start, eh, Mario. Your wedding pictures are really beautiful, Emiko. Thank you. Those pictures were taken right after the ceremony. Were taken. Were taken. Were taken <sighs> right after the ceremony. Were taken. Where was the ceremony? Other shire when shrine. people get married. Shrine, shrine, shrine. Ada shrine. When people get married in Japan, they sometimes have the ceremony at a shrine. Shrine. Yeah, I know. Shrine. Shrine. Uh -huh. Shrine. 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 Mm -hmm. That's but interesting. Were there a lot of people there? Well, usually only family members and close friends go to the ceremony, but afterward we have a reception with family and friends. So what a reception like in Japan? There's a big dinner and after the food is served, the guests give a speech or sing songs. A speeches. It's song like fun. Wait, wait, speeches. Speeches. The guests, or sing give, songs. Uh -huh. the guests give speeches or sing songs. The guests give speeches or sing songs. It sounds like fun. It really is. And then before the guests leave, the bride and groom give them presents. The guests get presents? Yes. And the guests give money. To the bride and groom. Okay. Okay, very good. So we are going to come back to the to the thank groups. you, teacher. Okay, thank, no you. thank you, teacher. Okay. Yes, sir. Thank you. Thank you. Hi. Hi again. You are mute, teacher. We can't hear you. Teacher, we can't hear you. You are I know mute. you can okay. listen to me now. Okay, sorry about that. 
Okay, so let's go and continue with the book. Okay, so we have this pronunciation, stress, and rhythm. Okay, so listen to this, please. Page 54. Exercise 10. Grammar focus. Okay, sorry. This is the one. Page 53. Exercise 9. Pronunciation. Stress and rhythm. Part A. Listen and practice. Notice how stressed words and syllables occur with a regular rhythm. Married in Japan, they sometimes have the ceremony at a shrine. Page 53. Exercise. Part B. Test the rhythm and these techniques. Then practice them. After the ceremony, there's a reception with family and friends. After the set, the bride and groom give them presents. Okay. Okay. Repeat after me. When people get married in Japan, they sometimes have the ceremony at a shrine. When people, when people get, get married, married in, in Japan, Japan they sometimes have a ceremony. After the ceremony, there's a reception with family and friends. After the ceremony, there's a reception with family and friends. Before the guests leave, the bride and groom give them presents. Before the guests leave, the bride and groom give them presents. The guests usually give money to the bride and groom. The guests usually give money to the bride and groom. Okay, now, and this is what we want to see, grammar focus. Adverbial clauses of time. When people get married in Japan, comma, they sometimes have the ceremony at a shrine. After the food is served, the guests give speeches or sing songs. Before the guests leave, the bride and groom give them presents. Okay? It's exactly what we have here. Okay? All of them. Are we clear? Okay, now, what do you know about wedding customs in North America? Match these phrases with the information below. So we have one, two, three, four, five, six, A, B, C, D, E, F. Before a man and woman get married, they usually what? A, B, C, D, E, F. So tell me what is the correct answer. They usually date each other for about a year. Okay, that is correct. Before a man and a woman get married, they usually date each other for, a, for about a year. Do you know what is the meaning of date? See that. Aha. Uh -huh. Or they see each other, right? They they go out together Some for hobbies. about a year. Okay, very good. Now, this is what I want you. The ones that have the book, don't worry about it. You are on page 54. The ones that don't have the book, please take a picture. Take a picture. Did you take a picture, guys? Yeah. Yes. All of you, Tolos, all of you? Mm -hmm. yes. 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 Are you sure? Let me go one by one. Do you, Jose, did you take a picture? Yes, teacher. Okay, Jordana, you took a picture? I have the book now, teacher. Okay, yes. Maria Ernestina? Yes, teacher, I have. Mario? Yeah, I have. I take a picture. I took okay. a picture. Alexander? Yes, teacher. Eleonora? Yes, teacher. I have. Ivan? 
Hello, Ivan. Yes, sir. Cindy? Hi, Ben. Okay, very good. So I'm going to put you in pairs. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, four pairs. So you can match the beginnings with the endings. Is that clear? Okay, okay very okay. good. So I'm going to recreate the four couples. And Jordana, you go with Maria Jose in room number one. Alexandra and Maria Nastina, okay. you go to room number two. Eleonora and, and okay, Ivan, okay. room number three, and Cindy and Mario, go to room number four. Okay, go ahead, please. Okay. Mario, room number four. Okay, very good. This okay. Is the, uh -huh. okay. Okay. I question and you answer, okay? Okay. Okay, but you have to lower, lower it down. Can you lower it down? Because we can see here the, the, the beginnings and endings. Can you hear me, Maria Ernestina? Yes, teacher, because I don't understand. Uh -huh, okay, so the I extra thing that we are going to do is right here. Can you see it? Yes. Uh, okay. This is the es la letra I, A, lo que vamos a hacer, ¿verdad? Yes, so you yes. have to Yeah, it's the letter A. Okay, okay. No, no, I don't have the picture. Okay. This is the A. This is the picture. Yes. Hey, yeah, very good. Okay, so, okay, number one, before a man and a woman get married, they usually date each other for about a year. Now, number two, the both of you read uh, number two. When a couple okay. gets engaged, the man often engaged. The man often Okay. Gives the woman a diamond ring. Ah, uh, gives ring. the woman a diamond ring. Very good. Now, okay. number three. Right after a couple gets engaged, they usually. They usually. Uh, ah, go on a short trip called a honeymoon. No, 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 no. That is no. after they get married. Honeymoon yes. en la luna de miel. Okay. Begin to, to plan the wedding. Begin to plan the yes, wedding. Plan so the wedding. right after a couple gets engaged, they usually begin to plan the wedding. Number four. When a woman gets married, her family usually pays for the wedding and reception. Exactly. When a woman yes. gets married, her family usually pays for the wedding and reception. Number mm -hmm. five. When okay. people are invited to a wedding, they almost always, number uh, five, give the bride and groom a gift or some money. Uh -huh. Give the bride and groom a gift or some money. Okay. Very good. Now, the last after, one. Right. After a couple get married, they usually... Uh -huh. They usually... Go on a short trip called honeymoon. Call, call a honeymoon, okay. Now, uh, read number one, uh, Alexandra okay. and Maria Ernestina reads number two, complete, right? Ending, I mean, beginning and ending. And okay. we go okay. like that. When you finish, then Ernestina, Maria Ernestina is going to do number one and Alexandra number two, okay? So I'm going to leave you, okay? Okay, teacher, okay, thank teacher. you. Thank you. Okay, very good. Well, okay, number one, before a man and woman get married, they usually... Um, ay, me olvida. <laughs> ah, uh, they, they date each other. 
for about a year. Okay, number two. When a couple get enga engaged, ¿cómo se pronuncia? Engaged. 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 When a couple get Hello guys, how are you doing? Good. We are ready. Hello teacher, we are already finished. You already finished. And yeah. did you practice saying the beginnings and endings together? Yeah, yes, and we change the rules. <laughs> okay. Very good. So Okay, so that was piece of cake, huh? Apparently. Yes. Apparently. Okay, now it is a piece. Yes. Don't worry about it. Okay. Yeah, that was a piece of cake. <laughs> okay, now if we go to the workbook, we have this. What happened at these times? Can you see the, the screen? Yes? Yes. Yes. Okay. yes. What happens at these times in your country? Complete the sentences. Before a man and a woman get married, they, they usually, usually date each other. Usually they each other. Okay, what happens when someone has a birthday? Her friend makes a party. They okay. buy a they cake. have a surprise party. They have a cake. They celebrate with a party. They celebrate with a cake. They usually tell the birth. The the birth. They the usually birth, get drunk. First girl or the birth boy, uh, boy, a happy birthday, or they tell them happy birthday. Right? Okay. Now in pairs, tell each other. Okay. Now. For example, if you do number two, your partner is going to do number three. Then you're going to do number four, your partner five, you six, and your partner seven. When you finish, you switch roll. If you did number two, now you're going to do number three, and so on. Is that clear? Okay, yeah. I'm going to yeah. break you in groups to do that. Are you ready? Yes. 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 Okay, so I'm going to recreate the couple. Take okay? a picture. Okay, get in, please. Ivan, Maria Ernestina, and Maria Jose are going to be in group number one. Alexandra, go to room number two. Eleonora with Antonio in room number. Ah, did you take a picture, guys? Yes, teacher. I yes. take a picture. <laughs> Okay, Eleonora, go to room number three with Antonio. Okay. Hello, we Maria. Have Maria Ernestina. You hola, right? hola, perdón. <laughs> Hello. No, no Spanish, no Spanish. No okay. Spanish. Okay. Remember, Perfecto. Ivan and Maria Jose, tell Maria Ernestina, no comprende, only English. Okay? No, no comprende, español. <laughs> no habla nada, say, okay? Only okay. English. <laughs> okay, okay. <laughs> okay, excuse me. <laughs> okay, I'm going to leave you, okay? pray yeah what happened after a students graduate they usually go to the university when a when a woman gets engaged um, usually um, <laughs> I don't know. They usually uh, receive a ring or receive a lot of gifts. You can say that. When a woman gets engaged. Yeah. yeah. Uh, when a woman gets engaged, she gets a ring. Yeah, Not gets a, a ring. ring. A ring. 
or, may, or maybe he gets uh, flowers. <laughs> maybe. Yeah, but remember that the, uh, the instrument that is usually to show engagement is a ring, right? Yeah, it yeah. could be flowers. Okay, the next one. Uh, when a woman, uh, well, when a couple has the first chill, child, 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 they usually get the uh, tired. <laughs> <laughs> okay, <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay, when a person retires, 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 it is. From work, right? Yeah, that's correct. Okay, they usually um, travel around the around world. the world. Yeah. Think think big. <laughs> yeah. Okay, do you switch roles? No. no. Okay, switch roles. I'm gonna give you another minute, okay? Okay. okay. Okay, bye-bye, see you. Bye-bye. Okay, when someone... What happens, Guille? I'm sorry, teacher. I lost the connection with the internet service. Okay. I'm sorry. It's okay. In one minute, we're coming back from the small groups. So just wait 40 seconds. They are coming back. Okay. Mm -hmm. did, did that happen to you? Sometimes it happens to me. Okay. But not, not the, but it didn't happen tonight. Okay. And what, what about the other uh, classmates? No, they have been here. They have been on. Oh. Oh, okay, thank you very much. Okay, so they are coming back in 30 okay. seconds. Okay? Okay. Okay, everybody is back. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, very good. Now, let's continue working, okay? So here we have, here we have more exercises. Okay, so we say, complete the paragraph with the information in the box. Okay, add a comma where necessary. Now, grammar note, adverbial clauses of time. The adverbial clause can come before or after the main clause. Before the main clause, add a comma. When a couple gets married, they often receive gifts. But after the main clause, do not add a comma. For example, a couple often receive gifts when they get married. Is that clear? And remember, you're going to have before, after, when. Okay. Now, number one. What is number one? Many newlyweds have to live with relatives. So yeah, newly married couples often live on their honeymoon. So what is here? Uh... Most couple like to be alone. Uh, newly married couples often live on their honeymoon. Mm -hmm. Most couples like to live alone. Okay. Uh -uh. Before the wedding reception ends. Uh -huh. Newly married couples often live on their honeymoon before, before the wedding the way. reception ends. Oh, well, before. Mm -hmm. before. Okay. And now, do we use a comma or we don't use a comma? 
No coma needed. No coma, right? Because this one is the main cloud. So newly married couples often live on their honeymoon before the wedding reception ends. Okay, now, when they go on their honeymoon, Most couple like to be alone. I told you to go to honeymoon. Okay, most couples like to live alone. Now, uh, like to be alone. Now, do we use a comma or we don't write a comma? Yeah. Yes. Yes. We need a comma. Okay. Yeah, we need, we a, need comma. a comma because the main clause is at the beginning. So when they yeah. go on their honeymoon, most couples like to be alone, right? So they can enjoy each other. Okay, now the next one. Uh, after they come back from their honeymoons, many new wolves have to live with relatives. Okay, very good. After they come back from their honeymoon, do we write a comma or we um, write a comma? Yes. Yeah, we have to use a comma. Yes. Okay, comma. Oh, my Many newlyweds newly have, to live, have to live together. Live. Now, the next one. They can only, they can only live, live in their in own place, place, place when, when they have, they have enough, enough money to pay for it. Pay it. Uh -huh. when, when they have they enough live. money to pay for it. Do we use a comma or we don't use a comma? No, no, comma, no, no, comma. no comma is necessary, right? Okay, no comma. Very good. Now, here, choose the correct word or phrase. In the United States, when a, when a man and woman get engaged, they send announcement, announcement. gifts, or receptions. Announcement. 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 Very good. Announcement. To their friends. Now, okay. What is number two? What is number three? Number five. Okay. So go ahead and start doing it, please. Okay. The wedding ceremony. The wedding ceremony is often held in a church. The wedding ceremony. The wedding. The wedding ceremony. Ceremony is often held in a church. Now, the wedding reception. The wedding the reception is often held in a restaurant or hotel. Now, the couple's friends and family often give, okay, you read it. The couple's, the couple's friends and friends couple's and family, family often, often give, them, give, them give them a gift for money. money. A gift for money. A gift for money. And number five. Gift for money. After, after the wedding reception, after the wedding reception, the couple, the couple usually go on their, their honeymoon. 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 Very good. Excellent. Sir, yes, I have a question. What is why, question? why the, why do they use hell? Because hell. It's like... Okay, now, okay, okay yeah. yeah, okay, hell is a word that they use to say where something is going to be taking place, uh -huh. okay, so, for example, the meeting is going to be held in a hotel, so that's oh. why they use when they want to know where something is going to take place. Okay. Well, so it does not come going? from hold. It come, yeah, it's the past tense of hold. It's yeah. the past tense, so that's what I under, I don't understand. Why, if we're talking about a present or a future thing, why do they use? It's often held. It's llevada a cabo in a restaurant or hotel. Yeah. Uh -huh. Now, remember the hold is a phrase so there, right? There so when we say somewhere. the wedding reception is often held, la recepción es... Eh, a menudo sostenida en un hotel o resta de restaurante. Oh, okay, no restaurant. Okay. Okay. Yes, that is a phrase. That is a phrase over. No, 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 no. Eh, it's no. It is a, a verb. Now, help in is because okay. it's in the restaurant, right? When I say help in is because 
is the verb plus a preposition. It's not a phrasal verb. Okay, okay. okay. I got it's it. inside the restaurant. That's what the in is for. <laughs> okay? More questions? Okay. No more. No, no question, teacher. Okay, Thank very you. good. Now, here. Uh, let's go to the reading. Okay, you need customs. Okay, so you know what is unique customs are, right? Okay, yes, yes. yes. or no? Yes? Yes. No. no. Costumbres no. únicas. Okay, uh -huh. unique customs. Look at the photos. What do you think is happening in each picture? January 17 is an Anthony's day in Mexico. It's a day when well, people, people ask for protection, for protection for their ah. animals for drinking. It's a day when people ask for protection for their animals by bringing them to church. But before the animals go into the church, the people usually dress them up in flowers and ribbons. Do you understand what is ribbons? No, what do you no. mean? Ribbon, cinta, uh, cinta. Okay, let me see. You see, like this is a ribbon. Can you see here? This is a ribbon. Okay. Okay. Now, number two, on August 15 of the lunar calendar oh, wow. Koreans celebrate oh, wow. also known as Korean Thanksgiving it's a day when people give thanks for the harvest Korean families honor their ancestors by going to their graves mm -hmm. excuse me your microphone. Okay. Thank you. Conversation. Oh, thank you. I'm sorry for the inconvenience. I will I will say to them that. Okay. I will say that to them. So, again, on August 15 of the lunar calendar, Korean celebrate Shuso, also known as Korean Thanksgiving. It's a day when people give thanks for the harvest. Korean families honor their ancestors by going to their graves to take them rice and fruit and clean the grave sites. Questions? <laughs> questions? No questions? No questions. No. What does mean teacher grave site? Graves tumbas. Okay. And grave sites El lugar de las tumbas. Like, for example, this is a grave site. Okay? Mm -hmm. Okay, thank you. Okay, very good. Number three. Long ago in India, a princess who needed help sent her, uh, her silk bracelet to an emperor. Although he did not arrive in time to help her, he kept the bracelet as a sign of the bond between them. Today in India, during the festival of Raki, men promise to be loyal to their women, to their women. In exchange, the women give them a bracelet of silk, cotton, or gold thread. Questions? No questions? No questions. No questions. Okay, number four. One of the biggest celebrations in Argentina is New Year's Eve. On the evening of December 31st, families get together in Hill. At midnight, fireworks explode everywhere and continue throughout the night. This is a day when friends and families meet for parties, which last until the next morning. Questions? No. No. On the evening of February 3rd, people in Japan celebrate the end of winter and the beginning of spring. This is known as Setsubun. Family members throw dry beans around their homes, shouting, good luck in, 
evil spirits out. After they throw the beans, they pick them up and eat one bean for each year of their age. So if they are a hundred years old, they eat a hundred beans. <laughs> Is that clear? Yes. Do you have any questions? No. Okay, so read the article, then answer these questions. Number one, can you read it, please? How do people in Mexico dress their animals on St. Anthony's Day? Okay, so how do people in Mexico dress their animals on St. Anthony's Day? So he says right here okay. that... Ravens with ravens and flowers. Uh -huh. the, the people usually dress them up with flowers and ribbons. ribbons. Is that clear? Yes. yes. Very okay, clear. Very good. Number two, read the question, please. Why do Koreans do Korean celebrate Chuseok? Uh -huh. Why do Koreans celebrate Chuseok? to thanks the, for the harvest. Okay. It is a day when people, it is a day when people give thanks for the harvest. For the harvest. Is that clear? Yes. Okay, very good. Yes. Now the next one, number three. Everybody read it. Why do you Why do you we make gift men a bracelet for, for the festival of Raki? Festival of Raki. Uh, why do Why do women give um, their men a bracelet? Okay, so because, because men promise uh, to be loyal to them. Uh huh. It's men a promise, promise to be loyal to to their women. Women. Uh -huh, that is it's yeah, a promise, promise to, to be, be loyal, loyal to their women okay or to their men in this case and, uh, because in exchange the woman. the woman give them a bracelet so yeah. in this case it will be to be loyal with their men because they ask why do indian women give men a bracelet so a sign to be mm -hmm. loyal with their men Okay, number four. Everybody read it. Why do families in Argentina, families in Argentina do on New Year's Eve? What do families in Argentina do on New Year's Eve? They have a party all night. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so families get together and have, and have a big meal. meal. And you can add this if you want. And midnight fire words explode everywhere. Is that clear? Yes. Okay. Very good. Now the next one. Number five. What, what do you what do Japanese, do Japanese families do during the Sesubun? Sesubun. I don't know how that is pronounced in, in Japanese. Sesubun, yes. I don't know. So what do Japanese families do during Sesubun? They so dried beans around their homes. Yeah. Yeah. And yeah. family yeah. members okay. throw dry yeah. beans yeah. around yeah. their yeah. homes, yeah. shouting yeah. good luck in yeah. and evil spirits, yeah. spirits out. out. Is that clear? Yes. 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 Okay, very good. Clear like horchata. <laughs> okay, very good. What does these words refer to? Write the correct words. Them in, in uh, paragraph one, line two. Them here. What does them mean? Bringing them to church. What then means? Animals. The animals, right? Remember, in a day when people ask for protection for their animals. By bringing them, them what? Their animals. So that means their animals. In paragraph two, line two, it, what it means, Par line two. So what does it mean? Okay, Korean celebrate Shusok, also known as Korean Thanksgiving. It, 
What it represents right here? Shoe sock. Shoe sock, okay? It represents shoe sock. Is that clear? Yes. Yes. Mm -hmm. Okay, very good. The next one. There, in paragraph number two, line four. Uh, four, their graves. So there represents what? Graves. 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 The, graves. the ancestors. The uh -huh. ancestors. Their ancestors. ancestors. Only two, their graves. Uh -huh. Their ancestors, right? Okay, very good. The next one. And them in paragraph three, line five. Paragraph three, one, two, three, four, five. Them. What them represents in this case? The, the, the woman. The woman give them. The woman give them. The men. The women give. Them. Men. Them. Yeah, but them. What re them represents? The men, right? The men. The women give the men, right? So them represents the men. Okay, and uh, this in paragraph four, line four. One, two, three, four. This, what this means? The New Year's, New Year's Eve. New Year's Eve. Uh, this is ah uh, New Year's Eve. That is correct. This is the day when friends and family meet. So this is New Year's Eve. Okay, very good. Now, the last one. Them in paragraph five, line five. One, two, three, four, five. Uh, throw the beans, they pick them up. Who is them? What them represents? Japanese. Yeah, the Japanese, the family members, right? The family yes. members. Is that clear? Yes. Yes, teacher. Okay, very good. So now that is the end. Okay. Now what I need you is that you go to the to the platform and finish. Well, the carnival time, I'm going to ask about this. Okay. Now uh, I want you to do a uh, adverbial clauses, the knowledge check on 3.13 and the reading exercise, and then go to the midterm, okay? Go to okay. the midterm and do all this, okay? Okay, teacher. By on this weekend. So Monday, Thank we start you, section number four, and the next week, section number five, okay? okay. Thank, Thank you very much for your time. I really Thank appreciate you. it. Good night. Have a wonderful Thank night and see you tomorrow. Have a nice Monday. I will be checking and sending messages. Okay, if I don't see that your names that have finished the, the midterm, okay? Okay, teacher. Okay. I will be bothering, okay? <laughs> okay, so please go ahead, okay? Bye. 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 Bye, guys. Okay, bye bye. Bye. bye bye. See you tomorrow. See you Monday. See you Monday.